So today's recipe is a little bit different. I'm going to show you how to butterfly a chicken and then we're going to cook it on the grill. And this is a great way to cook a whole chicken because it gets crispy all over. So it's, you've got all the skin, all the meat, and it's just a wonderful way to enjoy chicken. So the first thing you're going to have to do is cut the backbone out. And I've already started. Just go along the line of the back and go all the way up. And then you're just going to come back up the other side. So just get straight up here through that wishbone area and you've got the backbone out. And then you're just going to spread it open and turn it back over, breast side. And then we're just going to get it seasoned. I've got some butter, olive oil, and whatever your favorite grill seasoning is. And just rub that all the way through the skin on both sides. And now I'm going to get it on the grill. My grill is very hot and you want to go skin side down first and kind of get those legs turned around. And you don't want to keep it breast down for very long because your skin will start to burn and you still want to have that good crackling skin whenever your chicken is done. So I'm just going to close the lid and turn it down to low for about 10 minutes and then we'll be ready to flip it over and let it cook the rest of the way. It's time to flip our chicken. And I also, while I had it turned over, I seasoned the inside of the chicken here. And I'm just going to get my tongs underneath and just turn it right over. It's nice and crispy and you're going to do the good bit of your cooking on this side. And now I'm not so worried about burning now because I'm just going to get my instant read meat thermometer and put it right down here through the thigh area. And then that will tell me whenever the chicken is ready to be taken off the grill. So our meat thermometer has indicated that our chicken is cooked through and I think it is just by the looks of it. I'm just going to take it off the grill. Be careful, you don't want to tear the skin. And this is just a really nice way to cook a chicken because the outside stays good and crispy, but then the rib cage protects the moisture of the meat. So it's still going to be nice and juicy. I'm just going to squirt over a little bit of lemon juice and also sprinkle on some parsley. And this is a great recipe if you want to look it up. It's at cbs19.tv. And it's great too because you don't have to cook it as long as if you cooked it in the oven. You'll be surprised how good the grill is. So be sure to join us again next week as we do some more grilling right here on the Fresh Grill.